Hey everyone, I'm Laura Saliska at Moody High School. The Trojans are going to look a lot different this year. Not because they have different players, but because they are more experienced. Ten returners on both sides of the ball. We're way above the curve right now. There's a lot of uh, kids coming back, so the retention's there. Moody senior linebacker and three-time defensive captain Adrian Ayala is excited to lead a veteran front seven group. Everybody's returning. We only graduated one from our starting seven. And our secondary's done a lot better this year too. You know, a lot of we struggled with that a little bit last year, and they're coming off a great offseason. The Trojan slot T offense brings back a stable of running backs led by Adrian Luna and a quarterback that has a year of varsity experience. Dylan does a great job just keeping everybody uh, under the same key. He's very calm, very smart, and uh, he does a great job running our offense. This fall, the Trojans drop down to UIL 5A Division II like most of the other Corpus Christi ISD schools, adding Gregory Portland to the mix for six total teams. There you go. Just like that. There you go. Moody is projected to take the fourth and final playoff spot in District 14, a feat they have not accomplished in 20 years. Every chance I get, I try to remind them that uh, the Moody magic is real. And if you start to win football games, they'll start to come out. The 2004 Trojans were not expected to achieve much that season. They earned a big overtime win against Ray and eventually secured a playoff spot after defeating Miller 41 to 7. It defied all the expectation and to capture that district title uh, then was completely unexpected. Uh, but it was something that meant a lot and it actually showed that, you know, Moody could be known for football. A moment in Moody history that Martinez's son Ramsey hopes to share with his father. Let's go, let's go. Come on, come on, come on. We have a chance to do some ch change the culture around here. And um, he's always saying we need to make the playoffs, but I think we can rewrite it, make the playoffs, and win the first round. So that's that's what I'm hoping to do this year. The Trojans start their season with a road game to Teloso Midway on Friday, August 30th at 7.30 p.m. I'm Larissa Liska, Chris 6 Sports.